The AI automation market is exploding. And as someone who's been running their own AI automation agency for about two years now, I can tell you that 2025 is your year to break into this market. If there's one thing I've noticed, it's that a lot of businesses are starting to get FOMO. They're starting to follow the AI train, trying to implement AI systems into their businesses to streamline their operations and drive more revenue. But here's the thing. We know that this industry is growing, but the question is, how do you break into it? So today I'm going to walk you through the top technologies that you need to get started in my 2025 AI automation starter kit. All right, so today I put together a really clear, really concise presentation about each and every different tool that I use for my own AI automation agency, Botterra, that I've been running for almost two years now. If you want to check out my agency, you can view it in the description below. But today I'm going to walk you through each of these technologies that I really, really like and why I like them. You can see here that this video is separated into four sections. So we're going to go over technologies for building out your agency website building out chatbots for your clients, building out automations for your clients, and also building out voice agents for your clients. And we're gonna walk through each and every one of these individual technologies so that you can understand why I recommend each thing for these specific verticals in your agency. So first things first, you need an agency website. You need to be professional on the internet to present yourself well to clients and having a really sleek, functional and automation friendly website is a really great way to present yourself professionally to your potential clients and drive some really, really solid leads to your business. So that's where Webflow comes in. It's not just a great place for creating designs. It's also super efficient and beginner friendly. I've built out my agency website on Webflow, and I've also built out a ton of other websites on Webflow for my clients or for just friends and family. So I highly recommend Webflow because it's no code. It makes it super easy to create a sleek website that fits your agency's brand. Plus, it's integration friendly, meaning that you can connect it to tools like NAN, Zapier, and Make to automate everything going on on your website from client inquiries to project management. We can see here, this is a little sneak peek of my website in Webflow. You can check out my website in the link below, but you can see that it's super simple. I can just edit things by typing stuff in, and it's a really easy way to build out websites without taking too much time to get yourself up and running. So I highly recommend that you get started with Webflow. You can sign in and sign up in the description below. But with that in mind, let's move into the next tool. Next up is chatbots. One of the very first services that I recommend people start with when getting into AI automation is selling chatbots. And VoiceFlow is the perfect tool to do this. With its no code and low code options, you can design and build powerful chatbots without needing to be a developer or knowing how to code anything. It's ideal for really rapid prototyping and comes with a ton of seamless integration options that make connecting to platforms um, using things like Make and NAN a breeze. So whether you're looking to build customer support chatbots for your clients or looking to target any sort of industry that might benefit from chatbots, I highly recommend that you get started with voice flow. And I also want to mention that my agency provides templates to all of the different voice flow templates that we've used for our very own clients. You can check it out in the description below, but we have a template to each and every one of the chatbots that we've built that you can utilize on your own. So I just want to offer that to you all because it's a really great resource for getting started. And with that in mind, let's move into the next technology. Now let's talk automation, the literal backbone of an AI automation agency. I mean, it's literally in the name. This is where make and NAN shine because both tools are perfect for creating powerful, customizable automations without writing code. Now, I know there are a lot of different platforms on the market for this. Uh, there's other things like Zapier, but in my opinion, it, these two platforms have been the best for my specific use cases with their really simple interfaces. You can build workflows that connect your clients apps, handle repetitive tasks and streamline their operations. So whether you're syncing customer data across platforms, automating email responses, or even connecting a chat on voice flow to another platform, these tools make it so easy and affordable to set up systems that just work. And since they're so flexible, you can tailor every workflow to fit your client's specific needs. Really quickly, just taking a look here, this is make.com's 
web page. You can sign up on this page in the description below. And we can see here that their interface is super sleek. You can see I've built a lot of different automations and scenarios in Make. And here's an example of what it kind of would look like. And we can see that this automation here is super simple. It's a super sleek platform. You basically just link together different platforms. And I have a ton of tutorials on how to use Make and me building out this actual specific automation for automating a blog. Um, but I absolutely love this platform. I think their interface is really fun. But moving into NAN, um, this is also their main web page that you can find in the description below to sign up. I also really like what they do with their platform because they are actually open source, which allows you to, if you can code, customize so many other things. We can see here their platform is really simple, not as flashy, but I like that. It helps me focus. And we can see that they also have a really simple, really basic way to build out their automations. You just press on adding steps and it makes it really easy to connect to different applications, uh, whether that be something like HubSpot or Notion. Um, their automations are super simple, super sleek. Now, last but not least, let's talk voice agents. Now, this is one of my favorite verticals in AI automation right now because it's growing insanely fast. I've had a ton of clients ask me to implement them into their systems that I didn't get a year ago or even two years ago. I can tell that this specific aspect of AI automation is growing really fast. So 11 Labs and Retail AI are the technologies to get started building out voice agents. They are game changers when it comes to creating lifelike, emotional, and context-aware voice agents. And with these tools, a lot of the times, I feel that they're easier to build than people think they might be because most of the effort you need to put in is purely with prompt engineering. That's just communicating with the AI exactly what you need it to do. And in conjunction, you also use things like functions to get the voice agents to do everything from customer service to personalized sales pitches for people like real estate agents. So the high quality voice synthesis makes the interactions feel really natural, while easy integrations let you embed these agents into any system for your clients use, whether that be like phone callers and other things. So if you want to stand out in the AI market, offering voice solutions is a really great way to set you apart. Now, taking a look at 11 labs here, here is their main website page. Um, and you can see that they offer a lot of different things from creating AI audios to making conversational AI and just going into 11 labs here. Um, I went and like created like a sample agent for you guys and you can see that they have a very basic like system prompt that you can add a first message that you can add and integrations that you can add like knowledge bases tools and things like that and a lot of it is super duper simple it's a lot simpler than people would put it out to be like i said now taking a look at the retail ai dashboard here this is their main website you can get a link to this in the description below but as we can see retail has a lot of really cool features and they have a lot of different use cases everything from receptionists to appointment setters lead qualifications surveys customer service and debt collection there's just so many different things that we can use these AI tools for. And you just build, test, deploy, and monitor how they do. So I really like this platform. It's really nice. Okay, so I just went ahead and made like a new account using a random email that I have. And we can see that they have a super simple interface. We can create agents, single prompt agents, multi-prompt agents, custom LLMs. But let's just like press on single prompt agent here. And let's say it's like a healthcare check-in. We can see super similar to 11 labs. It's a big fat prompt that we're using to get this uh, voice agent to do its job well. So like I said, a lot of building voice agents is just really solid prompting. And that's one thing that I love about them is if you can make a great prompt, you don't necessarily need to know how to code everything. You can succeed in building voice agents. And there you have it, the ultimate starter kit for launching your AI automation agency in 2025 with Webflow for your agency website, VoiceFlow for building chatbots, Make and NAN for building automations, and 11 Labs and Retail AI for voice agents. You're now equipped with everything you need to dominate in this booming market. Each of these tools is designed to simplify your workflow while your clients and keep you ahead of competition. So what are you waiting for? 2025 is your year to jump into the AI automation game and make an impact along with some money. So I highly recommend that you follow my recommendations. You check them out in the description below, and I hope to see you in the next video.